Yo, hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Job Seekers, welcome to a tutorial focused on uploading your resume to Indeed in 2023. Indeed is a powerful tool for job hunting and having an updated and well-crafted resume is vital. In this guide, I will show you the sample steps to upload your resume onto Indeed's platform. So, guys, without no further talking, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So guys, the first thing that you'll have to do is simply head up to indeed.com. This is the most obvious thing. Then, of course, make sure that you have created an account as a job seeker. If you are an employer, then you will not find this option to post a resume about yourself. So make sure to post, uh, like create an account as a job seeker and then this page will be available for you. So here in the middle of this page, you'll find it right over here. Post your resume. So simply click on this. And here you have two options. You either have the option to upload the resume directly or to build an Indeed resume. Let's click on this one, for example. So here you are starting to build your resume. Let's start with this, for example, here. Uh, here we go. Yep, continue. And here you would like uh, to add like your number. You can click on continue. Uh, here, where are you located? Simply just put your own informations. Continue. Um, let's say like, let's say about, let's remove that, remove that. I'm just putting like random informations. Let me just put this one and try to fill it correctly. Hopefully it works. It doesn't work. Okay, let me just try, for example, this website instead. So I can get like real informations. So here we go. This is the street address. Uh, this is the city. Here we go. And basically this is going to be the code postal or postal code. And best thing. So now here, basically we have to add our education. So let's fill them out. So I'm going to use this uh, tool as well. Uh, fill into page. And here simply let's choose New York. Uh, time period currently enrolled. Or we can simply choose these times. <laughs> I'm going to remove that from to here. And now click on save. So this is the first thing that we got. We can add like literally every education thing that we got. But guys. Don't do it the same way that I'm doing. You have to put your real information so everything has to be correctly done. I'm doing this only for the sake of this tutorial. I'm not really putting real things. I'm not putting real information. But guys, for you, you have to put your real information so you can get accepted when you apply to jobs. Or else you will not even get in the waiting list. So now, after I create that, simply click on continue. And here we have to add work experience if we had one already. So I would do the same thing, fill entire page and click on save. Then click on continue. And here, what are some of your skills? Let's say that I am a business development, social media management, account management. Uh, let's just keep adding here. Once you feel like you're done, click on this continue button and now we are close to the end. What certifications or license do you have? So you can either uh, like upload them or simply just type here and search for them. Let's say, see, let's write here. And which, uh, I don't know, I'm just <laughs> typing letters and they are so me stuff. So let's click on continue. It's just your resume ready, continue. Uh, here, want to allow employees to find you on Indeed, search for on Indeed, okay. This is basically if you want to make your account public or uh, private. What are you looking for in your next job? Uh, let's say just the, the pay, I want it to be like per year, $200. Click on save, finish, and your Indeed resume is ready to share. Continue to profile, and Indeed resume, and this is basically my uh, indeed resume as you can see so here we have added the resume to indeed 
now this is using the resume that you like indeed has given to us but how can we actually upload our already made resume into indeed directly well if you didn't have your resume already created as i showed you at the beginning so here let me just go to resume help so here you will find every single affirmations that you will need to improve your actual resume so you can get a professional resume writing which will be 155 birds or 20 minute live coaching session for resume or 35 dollar for recorded review notes about your resume so this is very good to actually get a but a better job and to highly upgrade your resume so you can actually look bigger in the eyes of the employers but in general guys this is like basically it this is how you can add your resume into your profile so let me just remove that in case uh yeah here we go so here let me just remove it, delete, and here simply it. If you do have a resume already, click on upload resume, choose it from your files, and simply put it there. Here we go. I have added this as a PDF, and now every single person can actually see it and do whatever they want with it. So this is basically it, guys. So here it is a PDF file, and if you did it with the uh, actual uh, indeed the resume builder as you can see here this is the build and indeed resume they will see it as not as a pdf but as like uh settings this is normal page on indeed itself so the resume that you have uploaded can be downloadable but the indeed resume will not be downloadable at all they can only look take a look to it and actually having like the indeed resume can help you a lot since uh, it will help like job seekers to actually find you easily since they will simply just type for keywords and it will be related to your resume that you have in indeed and after that it will be simple for them to find you but if to if it was a pdf indeed can't really f like filter the pdf and make it look as a page and filter each words and match it with the keywords of the employers so that's why it's going to be so hard for you to find a job if you uploaded your file as pdf then making a resume inside of the indeed uh, builder it's a resume builder and yeah guys that was basically it for today's video it is very very straightforward nothing complicated about it it's just you making a resume inside of indeed or uploading it so as i said just click here post your resume you will get to that page where you have to either make a one or upload one so the one that fits you the best and just after that you have your resume good to go so guys that was it for today's video if you do have any more questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section and we'll make sure to answer all of your questions thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial